afternoon. Mm, that coach looks very inviting, but I'm not tired. Hmm. I'm listening to soccer. Can't get sleepy when you're listening to soccer. Downstairs. E can't remember who's playing. Ah, yes, it's the one I watched before they lost them too. That was, um, no, it was not Ecuador. It was Argentina. Argentina versus, is it Mexico? I don't know. Obviously, I'm not paying very much attention to this game. Oh, stomachs. Mm. I just got rid of these. Tasty. <laughs> Things that so easy. They're good. Really good. So there's a smell again. <laughs> Remember? Before when I smelled the duck feathers, yeah, I smell them through things. I smell them over many months. Nobody else smelled them, but I finally tracked them down and had to get rid of them. Okay, now I smell something again. It's again, same location, come into the room, just at the door and it's not as strong as that, or as horrible as that duck feather smell, but it's not here, it's there. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Maybe by the time I leave, I'll figure it out. Maybe I just won't. <laughs> anyway. Uh, got a package the other day. Um, And what was unusual is that the delivery guy, I think it was pure later, pounded on the front door. Whoa. <laughs> I woke up, ran downstairs, opened the front door, and pounded again. He said he pounded twice. And I finally got there. And he gave me my package and I said something and then he went off. And I, oh, interesting. This was really crucial. All sorts of important things that come, that have over the years come to the house. And nobody ever pounds on the door and insists that someone show up and take the package. They've left electronics, they've left, you know, all sorts of important stuff. This was a package of Christmas cards. <laughs> okay, the Christmas cards I ordered. Damn. I, um, he almost had someone sign for him. My goodness. Didn't leave that. <laughs> it was just weird. Very weird. Every one of these little things has a, has a different different uh, drawing on it. I don't know. There's a sun. Sometimes it has a maple leaf on it. Oh, there's a maple leaf. And also we got a little flower. Can you see any of this? Let's say another maple leaf. Another flower. Probably the same one. Another maple leaf. That's maple leaf. Not even an enemy. There's a sun.
It's really good and it's sort of chocolate mint. I have 10, one today. <laughs> Didn't have any yesterday. <clears throat> yesterday was, was, what did I do I can't remember. I don't know if I would even try to think about things in the past. Sometimes they're really long in the past. Doesn't matter. They're good. And they're tasty. I've noticed the time is off. Various clocks around the house. By two minutes. So certain clocks are exactly right on. Bedroom. TV, those are perfect. The stove is off by two minutes. What else is off by two minutes? What other time do I still have in the house? Nosy me. Tracy got, has got a visitor. And he's got a plastic pink something that he had long, so it's obviously not a, some sort of a visitor with a purpose. I also look to see if Tracy's got a boyfriend or a, a male friend of some kind. Wow, all these maple leaf, maple leaf, and oh, a curly thing, like a flower. <laughs> okay, now I have something else I wanted to tell you. Of course it's gone. Mmm, that's really good. Friday night viewing. What was my Friday night viewing? Well, of course, my Friday night viewing was, uh... wow, it is Saturday. Wow, losing track of the day. My Friday night viewing was Jeopardy. And then there was something at eight. Oh, <laughs> that Corgi thing. Oh, that was such an important thing for me to view. There's another one. It's the Hallmark Movies thing on the W channel. Oh, yes. They just intrigue me enough that I have to watch them. And as I'm watching, I'm like, oh, this is stupid. Why are you watching this? <laughs> and you kind of go, there's nothing else on. So I watched, and then 10 o'clock, watched till the end, and then I watched my show. Okay, I can watch that it's streaming. I can watch it at any time. I watched my show until, until it was over, and then I watched the 12 o'clock news. Wow. I used to watch the 12 o'clock news all the time. <clears throat> and because I'm trying to switch over my wakefulness clock, you know, I have been trying to watch it and I've been staying up. So now it's getting to the point where I, I look at my health, my health on my iPhone <clears throat> It's, I'm sleeping six point something hours. Used to be I'd sleep seven point something hours. Now I'm sleeping six point something because I'm going all the way to 11 o'clock. So I'm, I'm depriving myself of sleep. Hmm. Oh, well. I tried to buy a 
bought I bought a couple of things. Christmas gifts, no problem. But then, yes, two Christmas, oh, a one Christmas gift for Mimi and one um, thing for the house. Cat door. <laughs> I bought a cat door. I bet I had that on my on my list. I should mark it off my list. Mimi's list got marked off. Mimi's gift got marked off. But I didn't mark take the cat. I didn't put an orange stripe through the cat door. Anyway, um, I tried to buy today a, a uh, closet door because I have in my plans the end of the bedroom, which is under the stairs, uh, slated to be a storage closet door. A closet area so closet and storage area my closets are always storage areas aren't this never in these closet a storage area anyway it, I tried to buy the door and my mistake was damn I got to the part where I entered my credit card information and I put no I had the new the billing address of it Hmm. One of the two addresses, and I put my new address, and I noticed that the new address was not the same as my bank address. And it said, wait a minute, there seems to be a problem. I haven't had this problem before, I don't know why. How did I change it? So it's because I changed it right then and there. Uh, whatever. Anyway, um, it's, it's, you know, said, excuse me. Check this with my bank, with the bank. So I, I went to the bank and I changed my address. I hadn't changed my address at the bank. That's probably what it was. So my credit card is connected with my bank. My credit card information, which has the new address bank i don't think i've used my credit card i don't know why this particular site insisted that they be the same so i went to my bank changed the address information went back and it's obviously because i changed it on a saturday it's not going to accept it till sunday and i want to get the i want to get the uh the savings you know i thought okay getting this door i really like this door it's one of those one of those um, <clears throat> barn door things where it slides on slides on tracks. So it's a. I like pocket doors. I like sliding doors. I like anything that goes sideways. <laughs> sideways kind of person. And um, so I really wanted that door. I've looked at that for months. So I thought, oh, today I get you know. Over two hundred dollars in savings. So <laughs> buy it now. Like I bought for my daughter. She says, "Oh, I want this." You know, yeah, it's, and it's on sale now. Well, and she did it with a grin. And you sort of like, really? I don't know if it's on sale, but you know, we all think that we might be getting deals. Of course, we might not be getting deals. Not Sears, though. It's not Sears. There's no more Sears. <laughs> Who knows? Anyway, this this door. Looked good, looks good. I liked it, I've liked it for months. So, it's on my, on my computer, ready to go check. And it better check it on Monday when I push that button. And the Black, Black Friday sale might, must better still be on or else. My fault though, I changed, I changed things today. Had I not changed them and just left them as they were, I would have gone through. God. What can I do? 